Hey, what's up guys? Hey, before I show you uh, my graded card inside, I just want to show you the weekly investing I am doing. So here's the, the war turtle with the stamp on it. Uh, this is a nice promo. It's not too bad. I got this for like $8. It's not the most pristine, but it'll do. Here's the dozen uh, promo Pikachus I picked up. Ash's Pikachu, which is really nice. So, they're pretty cool to, uh, you know, pick up. I uh, sent a bunch to uh, PSA. Uh, but I think this is like a worthy investment because uh, there's a lot of Pikachu collectors out there. A lot of Pokemon collectors that would love to have this promo. So, but I can't wait to get them graded and see uh, what comes out of it. And then uh, here's the other cards I picked up locally for my uh, game shop. Just a little small investment, not too much. Now, I got I like these little uh, McDonald promos. Now, if I paid a little too much, comment below. Uh, I just want to see uh, your take on the prices I paid for these raw cards. So I paid for a bubble store. It's always good to buy one of the starters, you know. Here's another uh, McDonald's promo. I really love the hollow on this thing. It's pretty crazy. Uh, here's a shiny star uh, colossal. Here's a Pikachu. Pikachu is always a good investment. Uh, here's another shiny star. Uh, Charmeleon, Japanese base set. And then got yeah, Gligar. 75 cents, you know. I got a little uh, Build a Bear Workshop promo, which is I think is pretty cute. And I got this other Pokemon League promo, so... I think I paid a little bit too much for this card, but we'll see. But let's get to uh, the point of this video, too. So uh, I really wanted to show you the graded card I got. So, okay, let's see what we get. Uh, okay. Trying to uh, careful, you know. I'm really excited to open this for you guys. Good old Beckett. Uh, wow. Okay. The Beckett? The, the, you found the secret flap? I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you guys can read it. I don't know if they put something cool in there. Be crazy. That would be crazy stupid on our part because then you would just be around opening every box that you put on us for business. Come on, think of it. Come on, think of it. What are you even doing opening up the box? Fold this thing back up and put it on your shelf and probably display this. Okay. If you have more than one of these boxes, we suggest you using the spare to ship the cards to someone else. But don't use it if you are if you are selling the cards on stock because we got plenty. Seriously, if you can't imagine, if you're still reading this, maybe we do. I have some hidden treasure for you. Send a note. Hmm. Uh, now we're just writing to make up this pro unreadable release. It's uh, supposed to be because, again, there isn't any hidden treasure in this box. <laughs> this isn't the Goonies, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, I like like that. Of course, I have cards falling down. <laughs> I have so many Pokemon cards. They're falling down. All right. First graded card. Okay, I don't, I don't want to look at it. Keep it covered. Uh, okay. Uh, try to keep this head in. Uh, okay. Little advertisements. Okay, pretty dope.
All right, pull the card out. Okay. Uh, trying to not to see it or close my eyes. If I can get the card out. All right. Just want to show you. Oh, duh. And nice. Wow, nice. Pristine tin. Oh, nice. Ah, the cindering. What got me on the cindering? Uh, maybe it might be a little thin on this side. I don't know, but... Gosh, this is beautiful on a Beckett card. Or a Beckett case. Wow. Look at that bad boy. Wow. Ah, uh, it's like... It's like uh, that, that Vader meme. No! No, but I'm happy with the grade. I, I'm i pretty stoked. This being my first uh, graded card, so I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, yeah, this is... To have it be in this case is pretty awesome, so... Um, oh, wow. Ah, so close, but... But hey, I got a pristine 10, which is awesome. Got the gold label. But I love Beckett's like casing. It's pretty awesome. So. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys uh, my first graded card from Beckett. So I really like it. I'm, I'm pretty impressed by their turnaround, their efficiency on it. Um, but. I just think the Shiny Star V, uh, VMAX, just needs to belong in a Beckett case. Just because it just, with a black label, or even a gold label, just makes it sick. You know, uh, that's just my opinion, but, um, wow. Oh, wow. This is beautiful. So, yeah, tell me what you guys think, and below, I just wanted to uh, show you guys my first Beckett card, so... Yeah, so, alright, see you next time, guys, and I'll be showing you more uh, graded cards in the future. Later.